Hey guys, it's Chloe and today I am here with a brand new video. Today I am here with the TBR tag. I don't know who created this off the top of my head, but I will link the video in the description below if I can find it. Um, but there are 12 questions, so we're going to go ahead and get started. Question number one is, how do you keep track of your TBR pile? So I have a couple of different ways that I do this. The one main one that I've been doing for years is that, let me find an unread book really quick. On the sides of my unread books, I keep a little post-it tab. And when I read the book, I take it off. The other way I keep track is through a spreadsheet of all the books I own. And it's marked whether I have read it or not. And it keeps track of how many I still have unread. This spreadsheet came from Desiree from Libri Labra for her Shelf Mastery series. I'll link um, the first video in that series down below. Um, but that is how I track all of all of my books as well as my TBR. And then the third way is I have a shelf on Goodreads that is titled Physical TBR and those are all of the physical TBR books that I own on that shelf. And when I finish a book, I just take it off that shelf. Question number two, is your TBR mostly print or ebook? All of my TBR that is counted is only print books. I don't really read ebooks or use my Nook anymore, so those are not even counted in my TBR. Question number three, how do you determine which book from your TBR to read next? Mostly it's because I'm a mood reader. Um, if I do have a TBR during the month, I'll pick whatever book I want to read from that small TBR, but I'm a big mood reader, so I mostly just look at my shelves and find something that I want to read. Question number four, a book that's been on your TBR list the longest. So my guess is that it's Air of Fire and the rest of the the Throne of Glass series. I have had Air of Fire since like whenever it came out. I can't remember. It's been a while, um, but I'm, I'm working on Throne of Glass. A book that you recently added to your TBR. A lot of books just got recently added, but a, one of the recent ones is The Stars We Steal by Alexa Dunn. A book in your TBR strictly because of its beautiful cover. I'm not really sure. I don't... I'm not, I don't do that as much anymore. So I'm not really sure about this one. So I'm, I'm going to skip it. A book on your TBR that you never plan on reading, most likely Lord of the Rings. I, I want to read Lord of the Rings because I want to read it before I see the movie, but I feel like that's not going to happen anymore. <laughs> An unpublished book on your TBR that you're excited for. On my physical TBR, I don't have it on me, but it's um, Girls of Storm and Shadow by Natasha Nagan, um, which by the time this video is out, it has come out, but while I'm filming this, it's still like two weeks away from publishing. Some e-arcs that I have that I'm excited for are Of Curses and Kisses by Sonia Manon, Yes, No, Maybe So by Becky Albertalli, and I can't remember the other person's name. I gotta look that up. Um, and uh, Infinity Sun by Adam Silvera. A book on your TBR that basically everyone's read but you. All the Throne of Glass books. I'm working on them. A book on your TBR that everyone recommends to you. Um, probably Six of Crows. That's a, probably a good one. A book on your TBR that you're dying to read. Uh, <laughs> honestly, like a lot of these books, probably the one that comes to mind the fastest is the The Summer I Turned Pretty trilogy by Jenny Han. And the final question is, how many books are on your TBR shelf? The official number as of uh, the 25th of October is 81 books. Um, so my goal for 2019 was to try and get it as close to zero as possible. Um, it's kind of still stayed up there towards 100, but I have kept it under 100 for the majority of the year. I think what's going to happen by the end of the year is it'll probably be in like the low 70s. Um, and then a goal for 2020 will be to get it as close to zero as possible. I do unhaul often. Um, I don't film them, but I unhaul often. And, but I also bring in books too. So the thing is I have to read the books faster than I'm bringing them in. So guys, those are all the questions for the TBR tag today. I hope you all enjoyed it. As always, if you would like to check out my vlog channel lessons, it's linked in the description below. And if you like to see here, please go ahead and click subscribe. I post new videos every Wednesday and Saturday. So click subscribe to be updated for when I post those. Thank you all so, so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. In the darkness, I don't feel so